All right, folks, we're back. Man, check this out. So the ice starting to form right there. That's not good. That's not good. We don't like that. Now we're supposed to have a warm up coming up, so I don't think that'll be around very long. But the next two days, definitely, that's going to start to accumulate. Oh, and do the plug for the power. That makes it a lot easier to fish when you got that not attached to the boat. Yes, sir. We're gonna put some water in the live well. This way we can take a couple fish with us. Got my buddy Scott that he's gonna join us and uh, we're gonna go from there. All right, let's see if she starts up good. Here we go. She sound a little rough. She sound a little rough. And then we just let it sit here until it starts to circulate that water. Very important. All right, Scott's in the house. We know him, Mr. Positive. Here he is. What's happening? Getting ready to whack him today. December 26th, 7th. A little snow on the ground. I'm going to try a little something different today. We're going to whack him, though. Put some fish in the boat. Wind Rider, keeping me warm today, baby. Yes, sir. I did a little video on this. I don't have all the insulation in it, but uh, it's not 30 below today either, so we're good to go. You know, I'll post that video on a short on youtube channel so you guys can see it so if you're interested in his warm get up i think it's an ice fishing suit right yeah, yeah. uh you can watch it on the short and he goes through a full walkthrough of it that's pretty awesome what it, if you don't mind me asking what it cost this is 500 for the hayward and then they've got another version that's just as good it's around 319 but whatever product you buy it's well worth the money you spend on it yeah you you can't beat a a, a good winter gear let's see if this thing's ready to roll for us now as we head out there folks this is dangerous stuff i mean there's no doubt about it when you fish alone you just gotta i don't know what to tell you other than to have an ice suit that does float i believe his floats mine yeah. floats as well um, that's very important in my opinion and um, water temperature on this lake is roughly about a 10 degree difference between one side and the other so we're going where the warm water is that's usually where the crappie are at check out this ice formations right here that's pretty cool Right here, that's pretty sweet. <sighs> Plates better than never, folks. We got our first fish in the boat, and she's a dandy. Look at that, that's a good fish. Now we've had a search for these fish. They. We're not in the cove that we would have would have made sense for them to be in, I should say. But that's a solid 12-inch fish. Nice, thick back, belly full. That's what you're gonna get in this winter time is some really fat fish. And uh, this one is a perfect example of that. Black crappie right there. If you don't know, there's seven types of crappie. Uh, white and black being the most familiar. And hybrids and all that other stuff. And, I actually did an episode on that. But anyway, that's number one. That's a good fish. <laughs> Did you feel it? Barely. Barely. So folks, these fish are really hitting. They're not even hitting. They're just like placing it in their mouths. And you almost have to play the screen. It's so subtle. So yeah, folks, it's like uh, if you ain't playing the screen, you ain't catching fish today. They are literally just placing it in their mouths. And uh, that's, you know what? That's the eater I love. I love the small little guys. That's they the eat well. Mama likes it. Well. They may not be a picture fish, but they are eating fish. There's one. Oh, yeah, baby. It's going to be a good fish, too, folks. We're battling, too, with the ice on the islets. It's like constant. Good slab. 
right there. Guys, appreciate the color on that. That's a great fish. Good job. Stop bringing one in. Good fish. There you go. There he is, catching some slabs. That's a good fish right there. Well, did you have a fun day today, Scott? It's been great, man. That's right. Be sitting on the couch or scrubbing on rocks. There you go. Great fish, man. That's awesome. Well, it was a great day. We still got a look. Some really good fish right there. Good eaters. Solid eaters. Oh, yeah. Nice so. and brisk. <laughs> it don't get much better than that, folks. Check out 3-Pound Fishing. Please subscribe. Thanks again for watching, guys.